Well, hello everyone. Another intro into Goldwing Rehab, first gen, 1976. I could say that a lot more eloquently as well, but clearing up around the old Christmas tree, there's something that showed up from Singapore Santa to me. So, Singapore Post, Post Express. Singapore. I know what this is. It is. Oh, okay. We test it, test it. Okay. Singapore. Taiwan, not Chinese. And it does have a stamp from Honda Certified Parts. There they are. There it is. And the diaphragms, the down balloon, and the kit. Well, thank you, Santa. Because that means the journey continues. So, being that it's minus stupid outside, I'm going to play with the drivetrain, the gas tank, everything not electrical that goes crunchy crunch. In this episode. Um, wish me luck. Hope it don't freeze. That's your intro. Well, intro part two. Upcycle Garage. Merry Christmas everyone. As you can see, not really motorcycle weather here in central Alberta. It's actually warmed up. It's only minus 10 today. No hats needed. Yeah. And the last time where I left off was crunchy electrical. This old 1976 girl. I just started putting the mounts back in. And aligning everything. And put the shaft back in and I seen something that was really interesting the rear brakes the muffler setup and where we sit today I really don't want to touch much much of the electrical it's just a little too crunchy in this kind of weather so we're gonna work on the gas tank swing arm metal axles put the all the mounting hardware back in where we can want to work on the tank cuz Singapore Santa showed up part 1 here with the carb kit rebuild so there's movement that's for sure you like where we're going with this old gracious unit with the new head and the compression test confirmed. Onwards and upwards. Carbs, gas tank, electrical, and we're going to hear this baby bark sooner rather than later once parts start arriving. And I get off, sorry, I'm going to put this in no uncertain terms. And a shout out to Putin's Fab Shop in Putinville, Oklahoma. Sitting on your ass ain't gonna get your projects done. Minus 40, minus 20, it don't matter. There's heaters in here, that's what you hear in the background. And here's the game plan. So I gotta take that battery box to go there. Shots coming out. There's part two. When we get over to it, we'll carry on. Well, here we are again, carrying on with the fabulous first-gen Goldwing. 
Singapore Santa showed up with the carburetor rebuild kit, so that's on the agenda. Just going to do a little runs around the block here. There she is. I'll put her right like that. That was that. There we go. So I did break it loose. I did have the metric size wrench. Imagine that. It was torqued uh, 50, 60 foot pounds, 40, somewhere in there. It's with the old elbow tensiometer uh, measured, taking it off. I don't know how tight it's supposed to be, then you back it off an eighth of a turn, check for slop in the bearings, but it seemed tight. So, gas tank, swing arm, rear tire, suspension, all this, battery box, brake line. And take it apart, take a look at it, clean it up, put the right grease in the right uh, parts of the shaft. I did buy it, might as well use it. Put the right relays in the right areas. Cut me check. This is off the other side in Stone Cold. Like 1976. All day. That's at minus 40 sounds like up here. It's not minus 40 in here, the chill's going to make you feel any better. I got the fireplace on. Isn't that nice? Little ambiance. As we wrench. Let's take a look at this. We're going to go this on this guy. This guy. Go around that guy. There. All the heat's coming right here. Toasty. Yeah. So this side of the bike is preferred to work on the warmth. I noticed this because this axle was used loose. They're not as tight. And I noticed that I had extra, extra nuts here. And I don't know why. You can see in here how this is supposed to go back together. And I'm fighting me every step in the way, but it's still there. So, um, take it apart and do it right. Now that I realize the errors of my ways. So, that's what's on the agenda. Put them back down this way. Stop with the blathering. The 1976. Honda GL 1000 Goldwing. Plain Jane. Well, over the last little bit, 2022, we finished up some things. Didn't freeze to death out here. Right now we're in the middle of a Chinook towards the end of January, 2023. And it's time to move this one forward because other parts have been showing up for other bikes. Singapore Stan has been good this year. Carburetor's done. I didn't film it because there's only 17 Honda GL 1000 carburetor things on YouTube. So I did mine. Gave her the dip. 4.9 um, food grade solvent dissolver. I put 3-in-1 uh, oil. Back into the, I reassembled the carburetor correctly. I have one sticky float I would like to check into and fix. It's still inside. And that is it. That carburetor is complete and ready to go back on. Yeah. As I've been moving through this, though, I realized I've got a little dilemma with the drive shaft. So i got to take this back end apart. Wire's crunchy, so I don't really want to be messing with this. It's a warmer day. So, what you're about to hear might be different camera angles. I don't know if I'm going to zoom it in or just uh, leave you right there and dub you over, but uh, we're in the garage. It's 2023. Thank you for the new year. Subscribe. Oh, and uh, gifts. Port resolution. 
small little place on the planet up north. But she's uh, welcome. Welcome attire. Thank you. Um, <clears throat> what else to say? My subscribership is small, and I intend to be a little more active on the editing and up upping my game. I've been looking at cameras. Things will change. It's like a confessional, or uh, let's get the immortal words of, Mo of uh, <clears throat> Putin sitting on your ass. Ain't gonna get your project done. Look around here. I got a lot of projects, so no sitting on your ass. It's afternoon, late afternoon here. Oh yeah, new toys. Like timing. Yes. Did we bring up the book? Yes. And on we go. Glove up. Music off. I guess you want to hear me talk. The kids were saying that. I don't understand why they want to listen to the old man babble on. About Kaizen Engineering, Japanese, 1976. Things about this motorcycle. I hope to edit some footage, give you something different than the regular diatribe. There are some sounds that don't need to be there. Chopping the crap out of this one. Glove up! So, where we're at, spacers. Not quite sure what's going on. There it is. Number 25. Sorry, 23. Spacer. There's that one. Kind of looks like 23. There's this one. Kind of looks like 23. And there's one I have on it right now, which I have to show you. So, we got some disassembly. We need an empty little container to hold our pile of stuff. We're about to. Uh, Mm-hmm.
and there's our spacer the one we were talking about they don't kind of line up right with the world the universe everything else in between sorry to say so pin wrench Oh, we gotta get this up off the ass end here too. Hey, 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 hey now, mister. That's gotta go up. Yeah. Forgot something there, better do some editing. Hold on up. Shaftium. And there, I'll show you this with extra fine light. This indecision and derision. There's a spacer in the book. There's everything else, but something not quite spacing. Just saying. What do you think? So that's going to come apart right now. And fiddling with this one, trying to get it up in the air, and it's kind of fought me a little bit, so. Fight's over. Strapped it down in the front. It isn't going to fall off. Give her the big shake. Maybe. Oh, where's the rest of it? My tools. Over there. Oh, I'm pretty sure there's something man here that's going to do it. Looking like you. Mm-hmm. That was another gift. Bicycle, 1944. Tirana. Huh. Oh, yeah, it's gonna come. Little persuasions. Rubber end. You're coming with me. Bugger my threads. Coming. Come on now. A little more persuasion, so we'll go get a punch. Punchy, punchy. Punchy, I'm whack. Punchy, punchy. Maybe a little bit of a better walloper. Cutters are good. Oh, I got a walloper. Right there. One more meat in the... That's it, it's out. That is. Let's see if it's gotten any better. Can I pull her? Come here, mister. I like Kermit the Frog here. Come on. Come on. Polish that up. That wasn't bad. Come on. Let's twist again like we did last summer. Come on. Not copper straighten. Why aren't you copper straight? Coming. Tapinski. It's tap tap a roo. Tap tap tap. Tap tap out tap 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 it out. Come on, mister. Come on. Finally. We get to see the spacer that doesn't space. And 
still not going to see it. Huh. Hmm. Not buggered. Be nice. It's got to come out of here. That one? Nope. Which one? Let's break that one. A little roughed up. <clears throat> oh, get that thing out of there. That should have some uh, repercussions. Still not free. There's my secretary, good and tight. Well, that seems to be not quite it. Oh, let me one or the other. Lordy, lordy, lordy. I hope it's one or the other. That one is bigger. Yes. That will stop the madness. And that one is bigger. And does the insert proud. I'm kind of thinking this one. So let's take a look here. In there. Stops proud. Seals completely. Oh boy, that looks like the one. No, don't it? Now that one don't look like it. There is a seal in here. So when the time come, we'll take it apart and then we'll look at the seal for timing on the points. In turn, I'm happy with this. It seems to ride and seal in the right area and be of the correct dimensions. A wobble? Because that was just buggy. Buggy gone. Like an insert on an insert. Gone. That was oh, some grease and oil in there. Well, looby dooby when the time comes. That looks pretty good. There's the handbook that needs to go back in there. It's a special little guy. And there he is. 
he's got to fit just a certain way. No, 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 no. That's better. That's better. That's looking like something. Okay. Let's see here. Can I get that? In. I'm gonna give her little wiggles. There we go. There we go. There we go, Joe. Just a little tappy, 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 tap it, tap it, tappy, tappy, tap it. You know. Get in the hole. Go to your home. Get in the hole. So we got that seeming to be lining up. And this guy. Come on now. Woo woo. There. Hopped right in there, big fella. That's more like it. Seems to be the correct spacer. Snug. Enough. Big shaft. Where's the shaft? I had that in the end of it. Yes. Is it? Is it? It'd be goofy. A little bit. There she is. Right there. Ooh. One more. One more. There we go. Looby dooby wouldn't hurt. Or some looby dooby. Grease. Oil. I got oil. So, these two spacers might be for a 750 or something else, but that one was in the bins. And it's not right. I don't see anything else in the bins. So, enough of that. Need some more. There's a little bit of looby dooby. Penetrator. Yeah, clean it up with the help. Penetrator. Only no! She loose, she tight, she loose, she tight, she loose, she tight, she tight, she loose. She loose it tight. Tidy Lucy. Loose the tidy. Let's just see here. Sato, sato, sato. Sato. Lining up better. Okay, meeting up my chrome. Let's get the rubber mallet. Right tool, right job. Yeah, but I gotta take that off to do the work on the motor. I still want to see how things line up. That's pretty spuddy. That looks pretty good too. Singapore Santa and everything else arrived. Carburetors are done. Just uh, playing around with that uh, rear spacer. That's correct now. And we're going to move forward with uh, points. 
timing, eyeball it as the book says. So that's uh, next. So we're gonna cut away. You like where I'm going with this old gold wing? My <clears throat> three hundred dollar five tote basket case. That's what I do. Say what you can in life, and uh, save yourself first. Mm. That's the 2023 motto. Save it if you can. Save yourself.